Hurrah for lights. I've just made this simply gorgeous, gorgeous flower and I put it together with my handmade, hand cut leaves. So the other one I wanted to show you but it was too dark before because I didn't turn on the light was this one, handmade, except these things at the back. So, well, handmade um but i did use a circle die this is my new best friend to make these flowers you can make anything with this love it so these are x cut nesting dies so maybe 5.99 check amazon i'm not sure so um so i made this this the same way as I made that so if you check the video for this one you'll see um, and and then I just added the massive free hand <laughs> cut out and um, designed leaves so it's dark I'm not sure in the evenings anyway I'm not sure exactly what this flower could be. Hydrangea or something. I'm not really familiar with my flower names. And I stuck everything at the back with just a um, double sided tape. Thick one, wide one. And uh, just a circle cut out from cardboard. It's so fun once you get started. It's a bit slippery because it's like shiny at the back. And anyway. So once you get started, I mean you can't stop because I've been doing this for the past four hours maybe. Maybe, I can't remember. Anyway. Oh yeah, and I wanted to show you this. This is that rose I showed you earlier. And just to hold it together, I popped it into the lid of um, a soft drinks uh, bottle to hold the shape, you know, because the um, double-sided sellotape was parting from the petals. So I put it together to hold it together and hopefully when I take it out, it's going to be all stuck together neatly and nicely. It's a clever tip from myself to you. You can use it too. Take care. Good night.